Yellow Duckies, and welcome to I'll Be Brave Tomorrow. My name is Viola. If you like what you see, hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. It really does help the channel. So this is a demo from the Steam Next Fest, and there was a warning on opening it up that it is about child illness, cancer, and mental health. So do be aware of those themes in this game as we hop on in. This version of I'll Be Brave Tomorrow is uh, yeah, a please wish list to get to play the full game in September. 50% goes to Great Ors Ormond Street Hospital Charity. This game uses auto save. Please do not quit or turn off the device when this icon appears. Oh. Robin? Hello, Robin? Can you hear me okay? I can hear you. Where am I? You're in a hospital. You collapsed when you were at school. So we're just run going to run some tests to make sure everything is okay. Oh, okay. My name is Dr. Basanoa. Can you look to your right for me, please? Perfect. Thank you, Robin. Can you now look to your left for me? Perfect. Thank you. Can you now sit up for me? Robin? I, I can't move my body. I can't get up. Well, okay. We'll try again soon. I'll let you get some rest now. If you need anything, call Nurse Bella. She'll be looking after you. Am I sick? We're not sure yet, Robin. We'll run some more tests tomorrow to see if we can spot the problem. Are my mom and dad here? They're just outside. I have to quickly speak with mm, to them for a minute. So why don't you get some rest now? Okay. Thank you, doctor. It's okay. I'll see you in the morning. <clears throat> I think the doctor said I wouldn't be here for long. Well, hopefully, anyways. I don't like this room that much. Can't believe Dad got me this. This must have been expensive. And I can't wait to play that game he got me. Just wish the TV in here was bigger. Controller looks different to that old one Dad has. Why did he give it to me? Oh, my birthday is next month. Where's that game Dad bought me? Huh. I haven't heard of this game before. Where did Dad even find it? Let me put it in. Nice. The TV is on now. Pick up the controller and play. Did I play? Yes. At least I'm able to get up and move now. Found your first feather. Find all feathers in the demo to find the secret ending. Excuse me. You woke me from my nap. I'm sorry, I just need to ask you something. Have you seen my family? They took flight without me and I'm trying to find them. Oh, little Robin, I haven't seen your family. Don't ever wake me up again. Just this once I will let you off. Next time I won't be so kind. He looked scary. I should avoid him.
Don't look down, Robin. Don't look down. Oh boy. Why did I look down? I don't think I can do this. <clears throat> what do I do? I could jump across, but it's too far. What if I fall? Those thorns look dangerous. You can do it, little Robin. You just have to be brave. I can do this. <clears throat> Level complete. Bob has been trying to teach me that for ages. I finally did it. Now double jump. Press A button again when in the air to jump. Don't wake the dawn. You can wake him up this time. Let's just walk away slowly. Uh oh. You got to be kidding me. That's it, little Robin. You're mine. Got you now, nowhere else to run. Hey, you down there. Jump up, partner. Ow. That hurt. Thank you so much. Uh Sheriff Snail. I look after these parts of town. Why did you help me? You were in trouble. Any old sheriff would do the same. Anyways, what's a young old Robin like yourself doing out here, huh? Looking for my family. They took flight without me. I've been looking for them ever since. Tell you what, I'll pass the word on to my partners at the saloon. Jump on our backs and we can help you get where you need to be. Just try not to get into any more trouble, alright? How'd you get here so fast? Don't you worry about that, little Robin. Look, it's getting dark. Come back to the saloon for tonight. We'll take care of you. Thank you. But I've got to get going. I'm getting close to finding my family. I wouldn't go now if I was you. Even I don't like sliding around here at night. Just come and stop for the night. At sunrise, you can head straight off, okay? I guess a small nap wouldn't hurt.
Come on, Robin. Time for a walk. But Nurse Bella, that game isn't going anywhere. You can play it when we get back. Fine. Why do I need to be pushed around? I can walk around just fine. Robin, I know you can walk, but the doctor recommended giving your legs a rest. But I want to go play on the swings. I'm sure you will be able to in no time. I had no idea there was a garden here. It's lovely, isn't it? It's alright. Could do with a couple gold puffs. No way. You'd only go and break a window. Nurse Bella, can I ask a question? Of course, Robin. Why do I have to stay at the hospital overnight now? Is there something wrong with me? Robin, the doctors just want to keep you here to keep an eye on you. We don't want anything to happen to you. Now do we? I guess. I get to miss school. <laughs> Feel free to ask me any questions about things in the garden. Also, let me know if you would like me to stop at any time. Just press Y, and I'll stop so you can look around. You didn't stop soon enough. That cute little fellow, then. That's Mr. Hedgehog. He's the protector of the gardens. Nice to meet you, Mr. Hedgehog. You remind me of someone from my game. pond. Are there any fish in there? Sadly, not anymore. We used to have them all. Koi, goldfish, you name it. What happened? A really cold winter came. Hasn't been the same since. That's so sad. I know. It's sad. Winter can be really difficult for a lot of animals, but it can also be very beautiful. I like it when it snows. Same. I like it when my feet crunch in the snow. Do you ever have a snowball fight with the other nurse? Nurses? Only all the time. I wonder what they're building over there. I actually don't know. We're going to have to wait and see. What's this? It's called a bird pass. Birds often use them to drink, bathe, and just generally relax. Although, some say they can do even more than that. Like what? Well, I've heard the bird pass have magical powers. What kind of magic powers? If a bird drinks from a special bird bath, they get superpowers. They can fly twice as far and twice as fast. And if a bird is sick, drinking from the bird bath can cure them. Does it work for humans too? Unfortunately, the special powers only work on birds. But there are magical things that work for humans too. Eating your vegetables, drinking water, getting exercise. I think I'd rather drink from the bird bath. Let me know when you're ready to go back in, Robin. Will do, nurse. Nurse, yes, Robin, I'm ready to go back inside. Gotta play more of that cute bird game. <clears throat> this room is so much nicer. The blue walls remind me of home. I think Mom said I'd be here for a little while. That's why she brought me my things. What can I play with in here? Try 
tracks around here. Huh. <clears throat> I can't believe my cast cartridge broke. But at least this new game dad bought me is a great. I know what. Let me make something. Hey, I'm getting pretty good at these now. Let's have this paper playing around. Fred the Frog, my greenest best friend. I used to speak to him when I was little. Hey, Robin. Fred? Robin! How come you could speak to me again? Well, I thought you could do with some company being stuck in here. Oh, well, yeah. Thanks, Fred. It's okay, buddy. It's way past my bedtime. Good thing I'm here and Mom lets me stay up later. Mum. 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 Mummy. Mum. Mum. Anyway. Can't wait to get back out and play. Hopefully I start feeling better soon. Can't believe the poster came in the box. It's so cool. I love this painting. It reminds me of a really good book I read once. Howdy, cowboy. His hat is like the one from the movie that Dad loves. My favorite blue scarf that Dad got me. Game looks so much better on this huge TV. Yeah. <laughs> the saloon was something. Yeah. Sorry about that. It ain't really for kids. I'm not feeling so good. Why don't you jump on? up on that bird bath over there. I heard it's meant to heal you. Oh, really? Thank you. I best be off. Best of luck to you, kid. I just wanted to say thank you again. No worries, kid. Sometimes we gotta look out for the little guy. Hey, I'm not little. I'm almost 25 days old. <laughs> My bad, kid. What if I missed one? Oh.
feathers up there. There we go. Great. Now they fall down from the sky. I'm tired. Mom bought me more brought me more of my toys. I guess I should play with those. Space Soldier Sam. We always play the floor is lava together. Sam always wins though. The jetpack is the jetpack is cheating. Anyway, let's play again. Sure, I'm sure. Okay, Robin. Please talk to me, though, if you're feeling down. I've always been able to cheer you up. You sure have. I don't know. I'm just scared. What are you scared of? I'm scared that I'm not going to beat it. Oh, Robin. I know why you don't load up that game of yours. Mm, I know. Why don't you load up that game of yours? Find all the feathers. And then we can have a chat. Okay, then. Sounds good, kid. I love this RC car. Let's race it around here.
posters are cool. Although I think Dad wasn't meant to show me this film. Mum wasn't too happy. Space Chimp. I'm so glad Mum brought him and Fred here. I miss them both, although I don't think Space Soldier Sam will be too happy. Next level. I'm getting tired now. This rain. It's too much. I'll never be able to find my family at this rate. But I have to try. I won't give up just yet. Oh. Little Robin, just you wait. I'm coming for you. Okay, guys. We're gonna skip this for the moment. Okay. Click play one more time. Okay. Frog Frenzy. Oh, did I get some bonus or something because of it? Oh, it's death! Bonus level? Bonus level! What are you doing in the game? Surely this isn't real. I hope you're ready. I won't go easy on you, but I don't want to fight you. You have no choice. Prove to me that you can beat me. No. You scared? Little Robin too scared to fight me? Hey, stop that. What are you going to do about it? Right. Come here, Fred. That's what I thought. Just don't jump on my head, okay? That's ex exactly what I'm gonna do. Okay, okay, enough, you win. Whew. You were hard to fight. Hmm, I suppose I was. But, but, you won. You beat me. Yeah, I did. I can beat anything now. Yeah, I'd say you can beat anything. Run along now, little Robin. That was a weird dream. I was dreaming. I was dreaming, right? Fred, you'll never guess what dream I had. What? Tell me. I dreamt that I fought you in my bird game. Oh, wow. Really? Yes. Did you beat me? Um, well, yes, but I'm sorry you were going to land on me. It's okay. It was just a dream. I told you to, right? Told me what? You can beat anything. What do you mean? Told me before that. I'm scared I'm not going to be able to beat it. Right? Well, yeah, I did say that. See? 
In your dreams, you can beat anything. In the real world, you can beat anything too. I guess you're right. Maybe. I mean, you know I am. Fine, okay. You're right. Thanks, Fred. I need that. No worries, Robin. I'm glad I could cheer you up. But look at the clock. It's getting really late. Maybe it's best if you shut your eyes for a while. I'll see you tomorrow, okay, kid? Good night, Fred. Good night, Robin. All right, guys, so that is it for I'll Be Brave tomorrow. Thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell icon to keep up to date on all the videos. And remember to free the feral wildflower in you. Bye-bye!